oh, what a tangled web we weave when engines deceive. Honda and Alpine have found out the hard way that the FIA does not take kindly to cost cap violations. I mean, who knew that spending too much on building shiny fast engines could lead to a fine? It's almost like racing teams should budget. But hey, spending is the name of the game. Just don't let the FIA catch you in the act. Good luck with that. Imagine walking into an F1 race with a budget and going, hey, I'd like to go all out on this engine, but wait, what's the cap again? It's like going to an all-you-can-eat buffet and refusing to share the extra plate because you just had to hoard extra meatballs. Welcome to How to Lose Your Budget 101, those enrolled in the Honda and Alpine class. Now you'll be earning an F and a fine. How charming. Let's talk about the FIA for a moment. They've really stepped up their game. Who knew enforcement could be so thrilling? They've turned financial oversight into a dramatic unleashing of fines. Just imagine the FIA judges side-eyeing teams with their calculators, determined to catch them red-handed like some kind of budgetary superheroes. Not so fast, Honda and Alpine. Did you think we wouldn't notice that extra spending on shiny parts? And of course, this all begs the question, how deep is too deep? I mean, at what point do you stop and say, you know what, maybe I shouldn't spend my entire budget on more horsepower. It's like showing up to a potluck with a 25 layer cake while everyone else brings chips and salsa. It just screams, look at me, I'm far too extra for this party. Maybe some humility is in order. Let's not forget all the dreamers out there hoping to see Honda and Alpine fix their ways post fines. Picture this a totally revamped budget meeting where everyone shows up with calculators and financial planners. It's drama with a side of spreadsheets. All right, team, this time let's try to spend less money. And maybe we could, I don't know, suggest using duct tape? Oh, F1, you are a delightful circus of contradictions, aren't you? Now what's gonna happen next? Will they disappoint fans with more sensible spending? Or will they go on a let's spend more and get fined escapade? Picture the headlines, Honda and Alpine, the cost cap rogues strike again. What a legacy, racing teams known for their fine skimming adventures instead of sustainability. The world will be watching folks gather round as F1 drama unfolds. And here's the million dollar question for you, dear audience. Will Honda and Alpine finally learn to play by the rules or will they just keep breaking budgets like it's a weekly pastime? Will they use their fines as a wake-up call or as a let's make it a trend motivational poster? Seriously, who wouldn't want to bet on automotive shenanigans? Don't worry, the FIA is right behind them with their calculators ready. What do you think will happen next? Like and subscribe, please.